Hi, I'm Pat Hargan and I'm the advisory chair for Shelby County United Way, a member of the Metro Board. I'm an agency manager for Kentucky Farm Bureau and I cannot tell you how excited I am to have the crowd here tonight at Mulberry Orchard for our first farm to table dinner. A couple years ago, we started talking about an idea in Shelby County about bringing together agricultural leaders who've never been big supporters of United Way and in a way trying to end food insecurity in Shelby County. It's really worked out far beyond any of our dreams to have 150 people here tonight at Mulberry Orchard to address food insecurity and support from all over the county, whether it be elected officials, business leaders, volunteers, we've got everybody here tonight and I cannot tell you how excited we are to have our first event. Come back and see us next year. It's a pleasure. I'm Paul Hornback. It's a pleasure to be here tonight. Uh, such a great event. Farmers feeding families when uh, we've got so many kids all around this state, all around this county that uh, go to uh, school, wake up every day and they're hungry. I think it's about 15 percent. You know, we as farmers, we get out here and we work every day and we produce food. We never really a lot of times understand and get the connection that we do have a lot of people that are food insecure. They don't have the ability to have the food to feed them to keep them healthy so they can do a good job in school and everything. So, you know, this is just a great thing. You look at the turnout that we have here tonight. Uh, it's amazing. This many people have turned out. I think about 150 people have turned out here tonight in Shelby County for farmers feeding families. I think it highlights the big problems we have with the food insecurity problem and how people aren't aware of the number of people around this community to go to work or to school hungry every day. So thank everybody for being here. It's a great event. Uh, thank you United Way for the work that you all do and making sure you help all of our people here in Shelby County.